Oh, hey. Hi guys, Nick Miller here today. Uh, we're going to go over this planer for you. We have had to change a couple couplings here to make this all work for you, which we did with no issue. Um, we put, as they said there, this planer had some new hoses and new couplings already here. We've run the wire into the control. We've mounted the magnetic box right here. But what we've done, we have it set up. When you turn the key on in the machine, it's going to power the different functions for the head, but there is a toggle switch right here. It's marked strobe. If you flip that to off, it will also kill the power so that you can have your key on so nobody would bump anything. Uh, we've done it that way. So if you ever want to take the switch box out, you can simply unhook right here. Take the switch box out, lay it up. We run the wire up over and it comes down and basically hooks right here. Uh, we left it there so that it's easy to lift the boom up and down. You're not going to tear that wire off. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and fire up the machine. We're going to go over here, put that toggle switch on. We're going to pick up the boom, we'll curl the planer up. So let's say that we want to take and set our depth gauge. You're going to run auxiliary hydraulic pedal here in the center and you can see that that's moving your depth gauge we're going to side shift side shift left or i'm sorry right left so we have that all working the right it's supposed to for you tilting to the right tilting to the left all by tilting the pedal we even have the hosing on correct for you there so that you're not having to go a direction you're not familiar with shut that off by centering it. We're going to activate the planer head. Right there it is. Simply off of this button. You're going to push it to the right. You see the hose is flex. The head is running. That's off the center. The direction of planing is to the right. So hopefully that is pretty simple for you guys. Um, there again. This pedal is your auxiliary standard flow, which is this circuit right here. So that's going to give you left or right with your different functions of your switch. Center is side shift. This is going to engage the auxiliary high flow to run the mill head. So there again, that's how everything operates uh, with that control box. I'm going to go ahead and get down out. So you can see here that we have it all hooked up ready to rock and roll. Uh, it, the planer will come unhooked. We're going to unhook it from the machine and have the bucket hooked up to it. Um, that way it's ready to rock and roll. So any questions, 814-658-3066. Thanks guys. Have a good day.